On January 27, 1945, the Auschwitz concentration camp, located in southern Poland, was liberated by the Red Army. Now, January 27th is regarded as the Day of Commemoration, but what exactly is the Day of Commemoration? Why is it so important? World War II was a tragedy in our history. The Holocaust era was the systemic, bureaucratic, and state-sponsored persecution and murder of six million Jewish men, women, and children by the Nazi regime. Nazis believed themselves racially superior, and anyone that didn't meet their ideals were persecuted and deemed inferior. Nazis also targeted communists, socialists, Jehovah's Witness, homosexuals, disabled people, and the Romani. It's estimated that 11 million people were killed. 60 years after the war ended, the United Nations designated January 27th as International Holocaust Remembrance Day, aka the Day of Commemoration. The 27th is considered a day for us to remember and honor those millions of people who died in the Holocaust, and for us to reflect and educate ourselves on what occurred those years. U.S. and European leaders join the Holocaust survivors for ceremonies in which we are encouraged to learn and protect the lessons and legacy of the Holocaust. This year, the UN is holding various webinars, which you can sign up to watch, with topics ranging from the legacy of medicine during the Holocaust to the Chamber Music Society's virtual concert. There is more local events as well. The Oregon Jewish Museum and Center for Holocaust Education in Portland is dedicated to the preservation, research, and exhibition of art, archival materials, and artifacts of Jewish and Judaism in Oregon. There is also the outdoor Oregon Holocaust Memorial that is dedicated to the victims of the Holocaust. We as individuals have a responsibility to remember and learn from our history. We must share and preserve the legacy and events that occurred those years. Take the time, even if it's only 10 minutes, to learn, share, and honor those we lost and the history that shaped our world.